Are you having the S SD in it fail thing on your Ender 3? In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix it. The first way you can fix it is by popping out the SD card, turning off your printer, and then turn it back on. works for me and now I can I have media uh, print from media and whatever. If that doesn't work for you I'll show you how you can fix it. So I recommend the reason it didn't sometimes it doesn't work is because you want to click on change media and then you can remove your SD card. Oh, no, so now I'll show you how you can set it, do it, fix it on your computer. I just say I'm using one of the like um, converters for the SD card, it just came with the Ender 3. Um, yeah, let's get back to the video. Okay, so now that you're on your computer, you have your Ender 3 SD card plugged in. You want to right click on it, if it's still not working. Right click, and make sure you're only using the SD card, make sure you're not doing this on your drive, or else you're going to raise your drive. Click on Format, and I'll come up with this. Then, you want to click on, you want to make sure FAT32 default is selected, and however many bytes it is. I'm using a 32 gigabyte SS M and SD card, so it's going to give me this many bytes, but however it is, now you can change your name of your under 3. Now, um, and for me, I'm going to click uncheck the quick format. If you if it doesn't work with, with quick format on, then select on, on select quick format, and I'm going to click on start. Now you get this warning, and it will say warning formatting will erase all data. Okay, blah blah blah. If you have any data on the, on the SSD, I mean SD card, drag it off onto your desktop. I'm not actually going to do it because I've already done it. But uh, yeah, that's how you fix your SD card. And if it doesn't work, I'm sorry, I don't know how to help you. Um, but uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and goodbye.